Hello everyone, Happy New Year. It's Christy, I'm back. Um, today I'm going to be filming a little bit of a different video. So this is going to be a Christmas haul, um, but none of these items are horsey. I just filmed a Christmas tack haul um, and I'll be uploading that shortly. And this one will probably be uploaded in a few days. Um, so these are items that I got for Christmas and after Christmas on sale. Um, I will tell you which items were gifts and which ones I paid for. Um, I just kind of wanted to share some of these items with you guys because I love all of them. I'm very, very appreciative to my family for what they got me. And I just love sharing. I love watching these kinds of videos. So I figured why not film one for myself. So I'm just going to get right into it. So these were a Christmas gift. Um, they are Bose headphones. They are um, green in color with gray and they are corded. So they're just basic headphones. Um, these were on sale on Black Friday. So I asked my mom to get me these. Um, I really like them. Bose are amazing and I cannot say enough good things about them. Um, I also bought these for myself. I actually have them in my purse right here. Let me get them out for you really quick. So these are the Bose Sound Sport headphones. They're black. That's the only color they come in, unfortunately. And they come in this little carrying case. It says Bose. And they basically look like this. They're wireless. So they don't plug into your phone. They hook up through Bluetooth. They do have a cord that goes behind your neck and then they go in your ears for when you're exercising or whatnot. So they look like this. They're very cool. Um, sorry, I have to hold it in front of my face so it focuses on this and not my face. And I love these. I paid for these myself um, because I get a discount. I work at Best Buy now and we get a pretty decent discount on Bose. So I went ahead and bought me some nice headphones. Um, next I have, um, I have an obsession with tumbler cups. Don't ask me why. I just do. I always have. And my aunt got me this for Christmas. I also have an obsession with penguins. So it's a win-win all around. It's a Vera Bradley cup and it's got penguins on it. Um, and I love this so much. It's kind of on the small side, but it'll be perfect for my iced coffee when I go to work. Um, going along the cup realm, um, the day after Christmas, Starbucks in Target always has their, their tumbler cups 50% off. I learned this for the first time last year and I stocked up then and I stocked up again this Christmas. So my mom did buy two of these for me. Um, she bought me this one. It's just silver and it's got sequins all in it and it's really pretty and it's very sparkly and I love it um, and she also bought me this cup which has been spilled on apparently because it's very dirty but it's just a matte green Starbucks cup it's dark green just a basic basic tumbler cup and then I paid for two I got this one which I'm currently using right now this one is glass and it's a very cool like marble print and it's very very pretty. I paid for this because it was a little bit more expensive and then I also paid for this one which is a smaller sized cup. Um, it's like st stainless steel I guess on the outside and I use this for my coffee drinks as well. Um, so that was all of the Starbucks cups that I got but my mom also bought me a um, bottle for Christmas that I've been wanting for the longest time. She bought me a small bottle. I actually picked this out so I knew about it beforehand and it just looks like this. It's absolutely gorgeous. This is a hair tie just so you know. I get, I've already used this. I just put it back in the box for the video and it's gorgeous. I'm obsessed. I love this bottle. I've wanted one for a very very long time and now I have one. And I kept the little box because I think it's cool. Um, let's see, what should I show you next? 
Next, I bought, I got a ton of um, chapsticks after Christmas because they were on sale for 50% off at Target. Um, so I paid like nothing for all of these. I got a bunch more, but I only brought a few of them. So this one is peppermint mocha. I think I got three of those. Um, this is a chapstick duo. So the top, the pink part is peppermint and the bottom part is vanilla shimmer. I really like this. Um, I'm actually wearing the peppermint right now, although you can't tell because it's see-through. And then this one is, um, peppermint cream. I love this one. This is my favorite one. I got a bunch of these from Target for like $1.49. <clears throat> and then this one, I was only able to find one of. It's a combo pack. This one is sweet mint, and this one I think is pomegranate raspberry, which I really like. So I'm very, very happy. I love peppermint anything because, you know, horse girl, peppermint, they go hand in hand. Um, <clears throat> so those were not Christmas gifts, though I did pay for most of them. Um, next is a... Um, Christmas gift that my aunt gave me and it's a Vera Bradley makeup bag and it's got penguins on it so it matches the cup um, I think it's super cute she also got me a large duffel bag but I don't have it here to show you um, I already have this filled up with some makeup that I got recently um, I'm not gonna go through this because I don't really know much about makeup and I don't really feel like showing it to you guys because it's not very exciting in my opinion. But I absolutely adore this makeup bag. I think it's the cutest thing ever. Um, to go along with the penguin theme, um, I got this on Black Friday, I think, at Bed Bath, Bath & Body Works. It's just a little penguin bag and it came with um, three small body sprays inside. And I just right now have my... Um, lips lippies my chapstick whatever you want to call them in there and i think this is adorable i will use him all year round i love penguins next item was a christmas gift and this was something that i asked for and i think it's the cutest thing ever so it is a unicorn and it's actually a um charger for your phone so it's a mobile battery bank and it's, this is not the cutest thing in the world. So I originally saw these at Kohl's and then we were at Bloomingdale's looking for something. And that's where I actually got my bottle was Bloomingdale's it was on sale. And I saw these and I was like, that's really cute. I really should get one. So I told my mom they have them at Kohl's a lot cheaper. And she managed to get this on sale pretty cheap. And I'm so excited to have this. It's freaking adorable and it just comes with a pink charging cord that I had to put an adapter on because my phone has the new USB type C um, plug thing. <clears throat> um, next was also a Christmas gift. Um, my aunt got me this bracelet. It's a Swarovski crystal bracelet. I have a blue one from last year and she just got me a gray one because I wear this all the time. And I love it. It's super pretty. It's super blingy. And it's beautiful. <clears throat> um, next is an item that I bought for myself. This I purchased on Black Friday. But I'm probably going to be taking this back because it doesn't work with my phone. Because my I have um, a knockoff OtterBox case on my phone. So it's pretty thick. And to top it off, I use a pop socket on my phone because I drop my phone all the time without it. And this does not work with the case and the pop socket. So I'd rather not have to take my case off every time I have to charge my phone. That would just be really annoying. Um, so this was the special edition that came out on Black Friday for $25. It's still available at Best Buy for $25 if you want one. Um, just say no. <clears throat> um... I also bought myself a new phone case. It's an OtterBox case. It's just a basic um, mint green color. I think it's super cute. I do get a discount on these, so I didn't pay full price for it. Um, but I'm really 
happy to have this because I love changing my phone case based on my mood and the season. Um, uh, let's see. Let's take a sip real quick. Okay. <clears throat> um, so my dog is creeping in from the other room right now. And I have my sheepskin style pad sitting on the floor. And he's really afraid of it. And he's just like looking at me like, why did you bring that in the house? I feel so sorry for him, but I'm sorry. Uh, next is an item I purchased for myself. It's just a little planner. It's very small. Um, it has cute little um, cacti on it. And this is just a planner from Michael's just to help me keep track of my goals for this year. Um, I've already started decorating it with some stickers that I bought at Hobby Lobby. So I'm excited to have this and it's small enough that I can keep it in my purse so I won't forget to use it. <clears throat> and then this is an item that I bought myself but it's related to Christmas because I purchased um, a bunch of stuff from Shutterfly for my family members for Christmas and I decided to get myself something and I got a little notebook and it's got my dog, my other dog, my dog who died, and some of my favorite horses. Um, this, you guys probably don't know who he is. He's a horse that I worked with um, a few years ago. This is Jersey, the horse I leased. This is Andre, the horse I loved and lost. And then this is Lily. She was a lesson horse at my old barn in PA that I used to ride. And it's just a simple little notebook. This is what the pages look like. Um, I really like this. I haven't used it yet because I'm, I'm too sentimental to use it because I'm silly. Um, so yes, I have that. Um, the next couple items are going to be Christmas gifts. Um, I shopped around for these for my parents to get them for the best price. They got me some DS games. This is Hey Pikmin. I used to play this on GameCube like way long ago. And I also used to play this. This is Super Smash Brothers. So I have some new games for my DS, which I'm really excited to play. Um, my dad also got me a new PlayStation game. I have this for PC. It's basically the same game. It's very easy. I almost beat the game and it's not very accurate, but it's fun. You know, it's a time killer. So yeah, it's just Lucinda Green's Equestrian Challenge. It's basically like an eventing game. And then I got some movies for Christmas. I got um, Batman vs. Superman, and I got Poltergeist. I love scary movies, in case you guys didn't know that. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. So, my first, um, I started working at Best Buy in October, and the first purchase I made with the money that I made at Best Buy was a Samsung smartwatch. Um, this is the box. It's the Samsung Gear S3 Classic. I'm wearing it right now, so I'll take it off to show you. Um, it did not come with this band. I did purchase this band separately on Amazon, but this is what the watch looks like. It's just silver, and I have a navy blue band on it right now, and I love this watch. It's amazing. It's pretty pricey, but I think it's worth the money, and I wear it every day. I never take it off except the shower. I wear it to sleep in because it tracks my sleep and I just love it. Um, and I've gotten tons of compliments on it. So I very, very much love this watch. I did pay for it myself, completely myself, um, because I wouldn't ask my mom to buy me something that, that expensive. And so, yes. So this is the box it comes in, in case you're wondering. Uh, they also come, um, it also, um, make, they make a black version, which is called the Frontier. So if you want a black one, they have that as well. Um, the next item is not a Christmas gift. I didn't buy it around Christmas, but I just wanted to share it with you guys because I think it's really cool. Um, I have been obsessed with the little Polaroid cameras. But, and I actually had one of the little Insax minis, but I didn't really like it because you had to take the picture in the moment. Um, I really wanted to buy a printer for the Insax, and I didn't know if they made one. 
and I did some research and I found that they do. So I bought one. It looks like this. Mine is like a rose gold and white color. It's super pretty and it basically prints out little Polaroids. So these are some that I've printed over this year. My dogs on Halloween. Um, this is from a day I went to the um, USAT talent search at Gladstone. This is the horse I ride in lessons. His name is Bear. He's a thoroughbred. He's really cute. Um, this is me and my friend's horse and a donkey before she moved to Georgia. This is me and my friend's horse on a trail ride. This is the beach. And I just have a bunch more. So I absolutely love being able to pick and choose which photos I print out instead of having to actually take a picture right then and there because that way I can have more control over the picture and how it comes out. So I love this to death. It is expensive for a little tiny printer. The film is expensive, but you know, it's a splurge basically. Um, so the next item that I got for Christmas was the biggest item that I got and I'm very, very thankful to my mom for buying this for me. And it is a uh, Michael Kors backpack. Um, it's in the color Dove Gray. It's absolutely stunning. I just have a little polar bear um, hand sanitizer holder from Bath and Body Works. I love this bag. It's very beautiful. Um, I will have this bag my whole life. So that's the only reason why I splurge on bags like that because they're such good quality that they will last you your whole life pretty much um, if you take care of them. So the next, the last three items I had to show you, I paid for. Um, this is a backpack by Steve Madden. I got this at Macy's right before Christmas for $25. It's a very, very nice backpack. I love the color. That's mainly why I bought it Oops. for the color. It's burgundy. Um, and it's just a very, very nice backpack. And I always use bags. I'm a bag lady. I have a lot of bags. It's a problem. Um, the next item I purchased on Black Friday for myself. And I pretty much bought this to use as a tablet, pretty much. And it is an Acer Chromebook. It's white. It's 11.6 inches. It looks like this. Um, it basically can be used as a tablet, so you can flip it over. And it's actually turning on right now. It's touch screen. And I like to um, put this like this on my bed. And I'll watch videos on YouTube at night. Um, so that's why I got this. Uh, it was cheaper than an iPad. It was $179 on Black Friday. So I bought this and it's just a very nice little Chromebook. Um, you can't really do much with it except browse the internet. But, you know, that's all I really wanted it for. And to go with it, I just bought this little case on Amazon. It's super high quality. I only paid like $11 for it. It's got very soft lining. Um, it's got a zipper pocket in the front, which I actually have my stylus in here. I bought this from Best Buy. It's just a um, Wacom Bamboo Solo stylus. I, it was very cheap. Um, and this case is from Amazon, like I said. So that is that. I really like this tablet. I think it's very, very good for the price. It's I think right now it's like $250 or something like that at Best Buy. And the last item I have to show you was not a Christmas gift. I paid for it. Well, I'm in the process of paying for it. Um, and I bought this as a birthday gift, I guess you could say, to myself. Um, and I am very excited for it. I've had it since the summer. And I love it to death. Um, it's my baby my literal baby and in case you're wondering it's a camera so um this is the canon 7d mark ii it's a very expensive camera um it is a professional quality camera 
Um, it came with this lens. This is an 18 to 135 image stabilizer lens. Um, and I love it. This camera is absolutely amazing. This is what the back looks like in case you're wondering. Um, this is the top. So uh, the reason why I got this is because I worked as a pro photographer for horse shows in April for a week and they gave us this camera to use with a nice telephoto lens and I fell in love with that camera. So I didn't end up buying it until August because I had to save up money for it obviously because it's a very very expensive camera and um I do want to start my own photography business and in order to do that I have to have a really nice camera. So the camera that I had prior to this one I still have. I have no plans of getting rid of it. It's a Canon 60D and it's getting older. I've had that thing for three or four years now and the camera was actually dropped in the sand on the lens and the lens got um sand up in like this part where this goes in here to the camera barrel of the lens and i just haven't gotten around to sending it out to um canon to have it cleaned and so i kind of needed a new i mean i could have just bought a new lens but i wanted a new camera um this one just has so many so much potential um I've actually filmed some videos on this, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to delete them because I'm still figuring out how to use it and how to tweak the settings on it. Um, so yeah, this is my new camera. I decorated it with the, um, these are bracelets that I had on my old camera. So this one I got at a One Republic concert and then this one says live like Keller and then it says um, BK number 80. So the story behind that is the there was a boy in my college who was in my year who very unfortunately died in a car accident um this summer after our junior year so he didn't graduate obviously because he passed away so at graduation they handed out these brace bracelets to all the graduates so that we would remember to think of him on graduation day and it has his number on it because he's a football player and he was a really nice kid and um, he did not deserve what he got at all. But, you know, life, unfortunately, deals unfortunate hands to everyone. So I wanted to put that on my camera to remember that life is short and that you should take every day as a blessing and not take it for granted. Granted. So that's my little um, spiel for the day. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's kind of a bunch of like random stuff, but um, I'm very, very appreciative to everything my family got me. Um, I do work, like I do a lot during the year for my family. Um, so that's why I kind of get a lot. I mean, to me, it's not, it's a lot, but at the same time, I used to get more when I was younger, but We've been kind of hard up financially in the last year or two. Well, more like three or four years. But anyway, um, I just wanted to share with you guys. I'm not trying to brag at all in any way. Um, a lot of this I did pay for myself. And so I'm very grateful and appreciative to my family. Like I've already said a million times. And I love watching these videos. So I just wanted to share with you guys. I hope you enjoyed. Please, please, please let me know if you want to see more videos like this of hauls of non-horsey things or just non-horsey videos on my channel. Please let me know because I can film those for you guys if you want. Um, I'd be more than happy to do that. Just give me a thumbs up, okay? Um, so, yes, I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye.